for the opportunity to send moon and rising sign um i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for the wonderful support um that you have brought to me thank you for the likes and share i want to say thank you for being here and for um being making a, such as a support um, it is the energy of a fire week and with the energy of a fire week I want to say to each and every person um, there is going to be people working on their ego base from out groups organization government institutes and organization okay so let's look and see this month of September is a fire month and it has four weeks and um, this energy is the energy of the world so you guys are the only one that gets the energy of the world in this week okay okay let's go ahead and see what is happening let's see for the opportunity what's happening for you guys in the first week what's up no <laughs> I'm sorry why I say no is that it came up for uh, the Sagittarians okay so okay whatever <laughs> so um, the first week is about looking at, uh, looking within okay so for you obsolete um, obviously there are situation that you need to take a good look at, at okay um, because whatever it is it's going to be coming to an end um, because the energy of the world is there and the end in sight is to the two first week two first weeks are positive energies um, eight of ones eight of ones information is going to be coming to you so this is um, really good because in the second week obviously there is news that is coming from some people from overseas there's news that has, you have been waiting on is about to enter so in the second week some of you will be receiving some news that you were waiting for for a very long time um, is coming in in the second week okay um, yeah this is gonna be good news that is coming in so in the second week for you absolutely you were waiting on news and this is coming in let's see in the third week third week there is a six of Pentacles whatever the energy of the six of Pentacles there is help that is coming in so good news and help that is coming in so it's wonderful um, this is a positive energy this is earth energy so um, earth with fire so you have um, water fire and hurt now this is really really positive because whatever the help that is coming in is going to be positive it's, the, it's as if if you have a business a lot of orders a lot of um, offer is going to be coming in to you and this is going to be in a, there, a very positive way then we have information breakthroughs coming through information breakthroughs coming through so you begin the month with a major arcana you end the month with a major arcana so obviously um whatever is transpiring you're coming out of the month of August in the month of September you're coming out of the month of August to the month of September and what is happening and what is going to be transpiring you're seeing that things are going to be happening for you so let's see um, basically what is going to be happening from the first week going in the second week there is going to be some regrets okay is going to be really some regrets first week going in the second week there is going to be some regrets now whatever these regrets are it is a situation where you are just going to be deciding to leave whatever it is behind and understanding that we have to um, let go of things sometime Queen of Sword comes up whoever the Queen of Swords is this is someone who is um, an Aquarius Gemini or Libra whoever this person is um, you're going to be receiving message from this person this person is going to offer you help okay whoever this person is um, you're going to be receiving a lot of information from this person and she is going to be offering you some help whatever the situation was 
um, where you were thinking about a situation you have some regrets um, you were really thinking about some situation and you have some regrets some real regrets but um, information is going to be coming from someone and it's the nicest Queen of Swords I've ever seen in all the decks <laughs> I swear and uh, um, this Queen of Swords is going to be um, helping you out okay now some of you um, in the second week going a uh, third week going in the fourth week uh, um, you're going to be receiving help from the Queen of Cups now um, you could be receiving help from the Queen of Cups and um, you could be receiving help from the Queen of Cups and information could be also coming a breakthrough about this Queen of Cups could be coming true so some of you could be receiving help from the Queen of Cups but a breakthrough is going to be coming true now someone who's the Queen of Swords whoever this Queen of Swords is information is going to be coming uh, from her and she's going to be helping you out okay then we have the energy of the Sun isn't this wonderful um, so whatever the regrets is um, you know because you're looking within for inner um, inner guidance and um, whatever the situation was uh, um, the energy of the Sun is here with the energy of the Sun what is happening and what is transpiring is that uh, the energy of the Sun comes out and the Queen of Swords she is going to be um, helping you the, the six of Pentacles is here lovers wonderful energies um, the energy of the lovers are here so um, this is good some of you are going to be connecting with um, an Aquarius Gemini or Libra woman and some of you could be connecting with a Pisces cancer and a scorpion woman okay um if you're connecting with the, um, the the Pisces 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 scorpion or um, cancer person they're going to be um, they're very intuitive and they're going to be a, um, giving you some information they're going to be um, giving you some information so energy of the Sun and the lovers is, is a perfect thing this is harmony um, weddings um, yes weddings um, connection with people the right people at the right time this is going to be good the Sun with the lovers is always uh, just a beautiful positive energy the Sun with the lover is always always a beautiful positive energy it is um, it's as if the universe is awaken it's as if the universe stand in and decide to bring people together it is a wonderful energy whenever um, these two cards come together because what is happening is that um the universe decided that it is time for the soulmate relationship um, and these people to connect together so it's as if if you were being blocked or someone was keeping you away from each other it's as if uh, the universe is going to say no um, we're stepping in now it is time for these two people to meet because whenever two people meet it changes the energy vibration around you and sometimes people are not even aware of that and what is happening is that especially when the Sun and the love is it's all about marriage okay and um it's all about marriage the Sun and the lovers is is this is this a fantastic is the joining of two persons as as wedding it's the right connection it's a soulmate connection it is you know um, a happy marriage a happy family life permanent relationship is a relationship that is going to be um, last for a long time so this is good whoever you meet whoever you guys meet there is going to be 
reconciliation relationship renewals the ex are going to be returning the soulmates who have run away is going to be returning oh okay so you know you have twin flame runaways and soulmate runaway and they are returning home so this is good some of you could be connected to a fish Pisces of scorpion and this person run away and they're returning home in the third week there is going to be an energy of help coming in and this help is going to be coming in from the Queen of Swords with the Queen of Swords is you're going to be connected with this person and this person is going to be letting you into the little secrets about the Queen of Cups whoever the Queen of Cups is okay um, but not to worry outcomes Knight of Cups the outcomes is a Knight of Cups okay so somebody someone out there whose um, soulmate or twin flame ran away is going to be coming back someone who is um, an Pisces cancer or a scorpion um, between the ages of 25 and 45 is going to be returning this is the love of your life Yeah, this person is going to be returning in your life. 